How's training camp so far? Uh, it's been fun. I mean, it's a lot of competitive, um, back and forth, working on the little things that we need to work on. And I mean, it's the third day, so um, it's a good starting point, and I like where we are. This is your first one with the Celtics. How does it compare? Um, it's similar. Um, a lot of similar stuff that we, we did last year, and then um, having that year under my belt, I kind of feel a little more comfortable. So it's a lot similar to what we did in San Antonio as well. Does it feel like you guys are starting from a different spot, though, a different level? Yeah, I mean, we got a lot of guys back from last year's team, so um, not a lot of uh, introducing things. Um, just a little bit here and there with like Malcolm and everybody, but uh, we feel like we're at a good, sp good spot, and we just got to just continue to work on it. Derek, how have you seen Jason's leadership voice grow since you got here at the step in the middle of last season? Yeah, it's, it's grown a lot. Um, I mean, from when I was with him in USA to last year, and then um, obviously this training camp. So um, he does a lot of talking, pulling guys aside, seeing how we can get the best look and whatever it might be. So um, you just definitely see that maturity and the growth that he's, he's been doing. What part of his leadership style do you appreciate or, I don't know, take from? What do I appreciate? Um, you just know that it's coming from a good place. Um, he wants to win, and so it's always good to follow guys that, that want to win. Derek, what was your takeaway from losing the finals last year? Was there anything that stood out in terms of making a difference in the final this season? Yeah, um, I mean, there's a lot that we learned from last year. Um, I mean, being on that stage, going that far, uh, you can't really talk about it. You've got experience it firsthand, so um, just that knowledge, that experience that we gathered from from losing in six and um, will help us up in the future. Derek, how do you approach your shooting over the offseason? Did you make any adjustments to your form at all? What's kind of your process like? Yeah, um, just go back to the basics. So I always say, um, try to work on just not be flat, use my legs and stuff like that. So um, just try to stay in the gym, be consistent with my shot each and every time, even when I'm tired and um, it feels good. I see you working with Ben. Uh, it's been good. Um, I mean, I feel like you work with all the coaches, um, but Ben was in San Antonio, so he knows a lot of what I used to do back then, and um, I, mean, I like the stuff that we've been working on, so it's been a good adjustment. And, you know, you did some screen and rolling in the East Finals, on ball, off ball. Just, what do you think your role is that like? It could be a little bit anything. Um, be off the ball, on the ball, um, screening, ball handling. So uh, just try to be versatile in that aspect and do whatever it takes to help us. Yeah, what are you seeing, or have you been told anything about rotations and what to expect? Yeah, I, ain't, I mean, they haven't told me anything, but um, I'm sure that's just going to evolve over the season. And um, whenever my name is called, and anyway's name is called, they're going to be ready to go. So um, I'm not really too focused on that right now. How do you get a better trajectory on the shot? Are you trying to get your hand under the ball more, high release point? Or really? Yeah, uh, high release point, um, staying in it. Um, just stuff that we did since we were a kid. So um, a lot of time when I lean back and try to get a little flat, so just try to stay in it.